This brief tutorial looks at how to set up your 3G DVR. Please refer to your user manual for more detailed user operation guidelines. You can use the buttons on the front of the DVR or on the remote control to make these operations. Before we can begin, we must first initialize the hard drives we have installed. You can install up to three hard drives on the 3G DVR. To begin, press the menu button. Please select the setup and main menu option and then select the utility icon and select hard drive initialization and then you will see a list of the hard drives that have been installed. Select the hard drive and press start. This will format the hard drive and prepare it for use with the DVR. Now to begin recording, please press the menu button, select setup, main menu and select the first icon which is record setup. Select whether you wish the hard drive to be overwritten or stop recording when it is full with video. And select the checkbox next to schedule record normal for full time recording. You can select other recording options from pre-alarm, record motion and record sensor and you can also select to record audio. Next, select quality and frame rate setup. You can choose the re resolution you wish to record at and select whether recording is under normal circumstances or event based such as motion detection. Next we can see a list of cameras. Please select the checkbox next to which camera you wish to record. Select the quality you wish to record at and select the frame rate. Once you have done, please press OK and press OK again to come out of the menu system. We can now see a camera has been added and it is now recording based on our full time schedule. other menu items when you press the menu button you will see a, a main menu here you can select setup whether you want to manually switch record on or off instant playback display setup allowing you to pause live video see picture in picture zoom into a picture auto sequence between cameras or lock onto a camera other options include full screen and quad screen options. The setup menu features a sub menu. Here we can see main menu items, search setup which allows us to search by time and date and other event notifications, backup you can backup over the web, over the local network, to USB or a CD writer if you have opted for it. You can also control PTZ cameras. Under the main menu, you can see this graphical user interface. The first icon is your record setup. Second icon allows you to set up event detection such as motion detection. Next is schedule setup. You can leave this blank for 24 7 recording. Next is camera setup, allowing you, you to control camera settings. Uh, you can mask cameras control the brightness, contrast, saturation, even the volume for each camera. Account setup allowing you to add administrator or guest users. Network setup. We will look at this in the next video which allows you to set up remote access from any PC connected to the internet. PTZ setup. System setup such as date and time, DVR name, DVR location, spot monitors. Utility configuration tool allows you to initialize hard drive, drives, USBs, uh, recover the system, copy and back up your setup and upgrade firmware. And finally a diagnostic system which will diagnose your DVR and also give you information such as your IP address and your remaining uh, uh, memory. 